So welcome on this January 7th after an amazingly tumultuous day yesterday. So what I wanted to do today was talk about peace and remind us of unity and oneness. And we can put up all the barriers and all the separations that we want, but at the end of the day, we are all connected. And the fights we have really just get in the way of our awareness of that. So to the extent that we can focus on an awareness of respect for each other and love and dignity, because we are all connected and we are all one. And the sooner we remember that, the sooner we can live together in peace and respect for all and justice for all and oneness. So my first reading is going to be one of my favorite poems from Rumi. And it's his poem called One Song. And then I'm going to end with a Muslim prayer for peace. So as we get started, let's just Take a breath as we do every day. And today is an especially important day to do that. Just take a breath. And breathe deeply all the way in and gently release it. And as you do, just form the intention to find that peaceful center, to touch that place of peace within you, that place of stillness, of calm, of love, of oneness, as you take a deep breath in and gently release. Calm your mind like a pond where in all the silt and all the stuff just floats and rests on the bottom, leaving the water clear and clean. In the same way, we can still our thoughts, keeping our awareness on that holy center, that peaceful center of our being. So I invite you to take a deep breath in and gently release. Sometimes it helps me to literally put my hands over my heart because that amplifies the connection and it helps me feel a greater sense of peace. So taking a deep breath in and gently release, bringing your awareness to right now, to this moment. If you have thoughts coursing through your head, as we all do, just watch them go by. Release them and remain with your awareness on your heart space, in your heart space, as you continue to breathe in and out, feeling your heart open and soften and warm and just fill you with light and love and peace. So as you continue to breathe, deep breath in and gently release, I invite you to listen to this beautiful song, beautiful poem by the Sufi poet Rumi. Every war and every conflict between human beings has happened because of some disagreement about names. It is such an unnecessary foolishness because just beyond the arguing, there is a long table of companionship set and waiting for us to sit down. What is praised is one. So the praise is one too. Many jugs being poured into a huge basin. All religions, all this singing, one song. The differences are just illusion and vanity. Sunlight looks a little different on this wall than it does on that wall and a lot different on this other one, but it is still the same light. We have borrowed these clothes, these time and space personalities from a light. And when we praise, we are pouring them 
back in. And so it is. And so as you continue to breathe, as you remain in contact with that peaceful center, as you remain sitting in the knowledge that you are bathed in light, in peace, and in love. Let us keep that awareness of oneness, that awareness of joy, that awareness of community, knowing that we all are from the same light.
when you're ready, open your eyes and move around in your chair and stretch. <sighs> and smile. And so my second reading is a Muslim prayer for peace, also one of my favorite prayers. So I invite you to listen. In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful. Praise be to the Lord of the universe who has created us and made us into tribes and nations that we may know each other, not that we may despise each other. If the enemy incline towards peace, do thou also incline towards peace and trust in God, for the Lord is the one that heareth and knoweth all things. And the servants of God, most gracious are those who walk on the earth in humility. And when we address them, we say, peace. And so it is. A prayer for peace. So for those listening later, thank you for joining us and we will see you next time.